Hi guys, I'm Brandon Cananizado. And I'm Dilzari Resendez. And welcome to the last episode of Hashtag SU. Where we explore what's fun and trending in Negros Oriental. So guys, tonight is the night for hi and goodbye. Highs and goodbyes? Yes, Brandon, highs and goodbyes. This episode of Hashtag SU is all about saying hi to the summer and saying goodbye to schoolwork. That's great, Dil. So guys, sit back, relax, and enjoy, because Hashtag SU has a lot in store for you. Okay guys, this is it. Only one more week and summer is finally here. I'm so excited I can finally wear my new bikini to the beach. I'm so excited. <laughs> You're not gonna be there. Anyway, we took it upon ourselves to show all of you what bikinis look good on different body types. And for the boys, it's awesome shirts and board shorts for us. Check this out. It's summer! It's summer! It's summer! It's summer! Ah, uh, summer. The time to relax. The time to be away. Getting something. <laughs> Greetings, loved ones. Let's take a journey. Before summer starts, we students have to face a huge wave of to dos at school. But in case you can sneak in a little free time, go on a bikini hunt and look forward to summer. Women come in different shapes, but with the right kind of bikini, you can get that supermodel look that will surely be perfect for this season. Lorraine Kendrickson, the reigning Miss Dumaguete and member of Belladonna's fashion, will help us figure out what bikini will be perfect for you. Okay, so for ladies who have a straight figure, just like me, you can wear those triangle shaped bikinis and bikini bottoms that go on your waistline because that would flaunt your butt even more. It won't like totally expose your butt, but it would make it look, you know, sexy yet formal or sophisticated at the same time. So for full figured women, you can go with a one piece that has abstract like it has um, stripes on it that goes downward like don't wear stripes that goes horizontal because it will make you look more white okay so well that's me I guess <laughs> so what I do is I buy swimsuit that has ruffles because ruffles do kind of give more volume or something like that. Like it covers what you don't have. So for women who have a pear-shaped body and have a short torso, um, you should just wear bikini bottoms that's right on your waistline. Do not wear mid-rise bikinis or mid-rise bikini bottom because it will make you appear shorter. Okay, so for women with large busts, do not flaunt it even more, okay? Like you already have it, don't flaunt it, don't wear push-up bras, and maybe don't wear bandeaus as much. I mean, it depends how large your busts are, but just make sure that your bust won't seem that it's overflowing, if you know what I mean, girls. And I guess what's best is triangles, and to even make it more like sophisticated or to you just wear a one piece that covers it up because still they can still see that you have big busts. And just in case you need an extra oomph for your bikini ensemble, there are plenty of cover-ups and other things to pair your bikinis with this summer. Don't worry guys, we haven't forgotten you. Girls always say we have it easier. Well, they're right. Let's go check out some awesome boy shorts and printed tops. Let's go. on 
the colors that you like to wear. For me, I like to wear pink, orange, green, yellow, yellow, <laughs> orange, blue, purple, and black. So have fun and choose what you like. I would like to see guys wear more of colors, plays, checkered, because it's summer, right? And I want to see more colors. I don't want to see any blacks or dark colors that would make me feel like it's still or we're still in school, right? So there you have it, guys. You better learn from the experts.